Gemma's charm. It'll keep you safe. I heard there are lots of monsters where you're going. Be sure to keep it close, won't you? I'm literally throwing it in a bush. All right, welcome back, guys. So we're making our way back to the town to see all the people. Hello, dog. Thanks for bringing Cole back safely, Sandy. Good girl, I knew you could do it. I'm sorry, Gemma. I thought it would be funny to jump out and surprise you. I I'm an idiot. I'll never do it again, I promise. Alright, I'm done with you, bro. Like, grow up. I'm seven years old and you're still being a seven-year-old boy. Like, grow up. Alright. Alright, I'll talk to this dude now. A lightning struck the door. I must confess, I feared for your safety, but it seems you escaped unharmed. Truly, we must give thanks to the spirit of the land who watches over us all. Truly, we should. Thank you, spirit of the land. We love you. Oh, look at this kid on the rock. That lightning was so scary, the sky flashed and there was this big bang. Boom! I was there. Oh, look, everyone's so happy to see us. It's so sweet. We love a reunion. We're back safe and sound, Grandad. Indeed you are, my dear. When we saw lightning striking up there, we got a little worried, I have to tell you. <laughs> Explains what happens on top of the toll. <laughs> well, I never... Sounds like it's nothing short of a miracle that you made it back in one piece. Is he talking out of his mustache? Well, there's no doubt about it. The spirit of the land was watching over you. Now tell me, my dear, how was the view from the top? Oh, it was wonderful. I saw the sea stretch into the horizon and the sunlight playing on the water and... Oh, I've never seen anything like it in my life. I'll wait till you see it from the back. <laughs> You're true cobblestonians now. Only we have the pleasure of looking out over the world of Erdria in such breathtaking fashion, you know. I feel like that's just not true. Uh, you're still young, and the day may yet come when you decide to leave Cobblestone behind. I think it's today, actually. I hope our little ceremony has opened your eyes to a little of what may await you out there. Now, it's high time we were heading back. I'm sure your mother is eager to hear how things went, young man. Don't keep poor Amber in suspense. Oh, my mom's name is Amber? That's cute. Come on, you. Home time. When characters are asleep, they'll be completely open to attack, but the impact of the physical force may also be enough to bring them around. Spells, on the other hand, can often work their magic without work, waking the target. Lost? Confused? Can't figure out what to do next? Google it. Oh, this is so cute. Little valley town. It's like, uh, Kokoriku Village in Breath of the Wild, kinda. Awarded for ascending to the top of Cobblestone Tour, completed the ceremony that signifies the one's onset of adulthood. Sorry that I can't read. Um, yeah, well, we can talk to this guy. Welcome back. So the ceremony is all done. Congrats. Now, tell me you've forgotten where you live after all the excitement. Just follow the paving stones, you'll find your way back. Oh, but you must be tired from forgetting that. Tired to be forgetting that. You should head home and put your feet up. Thanks, bro. Bro's got my back. Let's go up this ladder first. Okay, please. <laughs> Ladders are my worst enemy in almost every game. But it's fine, we did it. His feet look like they're moving slower than his hands or something. Whatever. Yeah, this is so cute. I'm really into this game. I heard it's a long freaking game too, so... I'm just... I'm glad I'll be able to play this for a while. <laughs> that is so funny to me, I don't know. Like, I'm just... I'm probably gonna be doing that in real life all the time now. I mean, probably not with, like, glass pots, but I'm just gonna... do that to be a dick. Awarded for collecting 10 different types of items. <laughs> Why do they give us stuff for all of this? Alright, let's see what we got. 
Cobblestone sword. Cobblestone great sword. Carried by so does more attack. So it doesn't. Okay, so I'm guessing if I have that, I can't equip my pot lid though. Black chance five percent. Yeah, I'd rather have that. Bandana. So, do I actually put it on, or is it just like, it's just like how accessories work? I mean, it raises our stats, so why not? So we can have our plain clothes or this thing. Oh, okay. Uh, I kind of like the plain clothes better, but these clothes are better. So we're gonna put those on. We don't got any equipment yet. All right, cool. Um, let's get on with it. Wait, can I throw these boxes though? No. Alrighty. Yeah, the view from right here is pretty decent too, guys. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, let's go back down. This town music is so cute. I'm- oh, jeez. Okay, well, at least there's no fall damage. Hard to talk to you, bro. Oh, he just wants to make sure I know my way home. Notice to parents, the tour isn't safe for children. Please make sure they know not to play there. Don't tell me how to raise my fucking kid. Oh shit, I thought that was a headless horse. Sorry, sorry. Let's just get on with it. I mean, we can explore a little bit later, but... I don't know. I think, uh... I think I'm gonna try to stick to the main quest. I mean, I'll do side quests too and stuff, but... I think I'm gonna try to streamline it for the actual what I show you guys, and then maybe I'll do some exploring on my own time. You know, just so that you guys don't have to watch me run around in circles for three hours. Are you trying to tell me this is my house? Yeah, this is the one? We've got some cool... Uh, this is really cute. I really like this little, little town. I'd live here. I'm actually going to Ireland this summer, so I'm pretty freaking pumped for that. Ooh. Here's my little soldier. Well, not so little anymore. I've heard all about your big adventure. Look at you, all grown up. I hope he wasn't too much of a bother, Gemma dear. <laughs> of course not. Gemma is the worst person I've had. Quite the opposite, in fact. You would have been proud of him. We got attacked by a monster at the top of the tour, and I ended up hanging onto the edge of the cliff by my fingertips. I thought I was done for. Yeah, there's always next time, Gemma. But you'll never guess what happened next. That mark on his hand suddenly lit up, and a bolt of lightning hit the monster. What did you say? That funny little mark? Lightning flying about the place? Goodness me. Here I was hoping he'd turn out nice and ordinary, but it seems his grandfather was right all along. I'm a prince, Mom. You just wouldn't understand. Well, we've been putting this off for long enough now. You and me need to have a little talk. Well, shit. Here, this belongs to you. Ooh, that's kind of pretty. Thanks for the bling, Your Ma. Your grandfather asked me to give you it once you'd come of age and climbed the tour. The truth is, there's something I've been keeping a secret all these years. Something I've never told another soul in the village. It's... how can I put this now? Um... well... He said you're... Okay, the suspense is killing the me. the reincarnation of the Luminary. What? Yeah, excuse me? Oh, don't ask me what the old fool meant, dear. I haven't got the foggiest. All I know is that your grandfather said you had a special destiny and that there was something you had to do. He said that when you came of age, you were to head north to the capital up there in Heliodor, and show that necklace thingy to the king. He seemed to think that if you did that, all would become clear. 
Clear as mud, I shouldn't wonder. Hmm. Anyway, the long and short of it is that if you want to find out what this is all about, you'll have to leave Cobblestone and head over to Heliodor. All right, got a little adventure okay. set up. Oh, ma, don't be like that. <laughs> well, I can't stop you leaving, I'm sure, but you won't be marching on an empty stomach. Come on, dinner. <laughs> the sweet little lady. Wow, we really got adopted by the right person. The reincarnation of the luminary. Launcher tries his hardest to sleep, but he's too confused by everything he's learned and excited about his upcoming trip. Eventually. Eventually. You guys will have to watch the, uh, I think that was the Amanda show, or maybe it was all that or something. Oh, ma, come on. Having trouble sleeping, are we? Well, it's no surprise after all the excitement today and your big news. Whenever I have trouble not enough, I like to take a little walk. The night air always does me a power of good. You know, that is some good wise wisdom that you got there. Walking solves a lot of things. So, doesn't look like we got a whole much going on in this little room. Is this where our bed is? No? Storage? That's all good. Oh, but we got some more pots to throw. Ten gold coins. Yeah, that was fun. Alright, let's go for a walk. That's what Mama said. Should I get your ass out of my house? Um, yeah, so it looks like we gotta make our way to the, the castle town and, and claim our, uh, claim our rightful spot in the throne or whatever. Probably what that means. So, I guess I'm going for a little walk. Uh, that's all I know what to do. They let me leave, so. I kinda like how this building looks. People of Cobblestone must give thanks and what for, must give our blessings. People of Cobblestone, we must give thanks for our blessings every day. Come say a prayer of gratitude. Okay, I guess, I guess they don't want us to be grateful right now. Alright, we can run. Forgot about that. Why walk when you can run? Man, no one wants me in their house. Aw, it's, uh, it's our friend here, Gemma. Oh, can't sleep either, eh? You remember this tree, don't you? How could I forget this tree? I got my scarf stuck in it all those years ago. There I was, crying like mad, and there you were, running round trying to help me get it down. <laughs> Some things never change, eh? You know, I always imagined we'd spend our whole lives right here in Cobblestone. Wow, I was... That's why I was so surprised by what your mum said today. All that stuff about you being the luminary... That reincarnation thing. <sighs> I remember the story my granddad told me. Once upon a time, long, long ago, the world was terrorized by a horrible monster. But then, the Luminary appeared and saved the day. Hmm, sounds like a little foreshadowing. When it was all over, the Luminary turned into a star. And he's been watching over us from up in the heavens ever since. That's his star, right there. Hmm, so is that what give us the lightning power then? <sighs> How can you be the luminary too? I... I just don't get it. I know. That's what you're going to Heliodor to find out. I understand. Really, I do. Listen, we should both be getting back. Everyone will be wondering where we've got to. I think they have a pretty good idea. Goodbye, Joking. old friend. I will miss you dearly, Gemma.
Thank God, man. Exhausted after his long day, Lancia finally falls into a restless slumber. The woman comes. Aw, cute little sleepy sound. Hasn't moved a whole lot since the last time we saw her. <laughs> well, just look at you. You don't scrub up too bad, you know. Only wish your grandfather were here to see you. Oh, sad. You won't forget him, will you? He was a fine, upstanding man, the pride of the village. You could do worse than try to be like him. Well, however you turn out, I'm sure you'll find a way to overcome whatever lies ahead. A mother knows these things. Oh, by the way, I've popped a little money I'd saved for a rainy day in your pack. Don't spend it all at once. I wouldn't Why don't you dream visit of the it. village shop before you head off to Heliodor? <clears throat> You'll need some supplies for your big adventure. Yeah, that's but a good idea. But don't take too long. The whole village is turning out to wave you off. Ah. Oh, they love us so bad, so so much. It's all right. We'll be back to visit, probably. Yeah. So let's uh get out of here. We'll go check out the store like Mama told us to. Don't want to go on our adventure unprepared. Uh, I thought I passed it earlier when I wanted to go for my walk. What you gotta say? I heard about it from your mother. She said there is an important journey you have to make, and you just a youngster. Well, before you head off, make sure to visit the shop. You know where it is, of course, down the slope, across the river. Once you're stocked up, head up to the village entrance to the north. We'll be waiting to see you off. Thanks, old man. Thanks, old man. That was very helpful. Set across the river, right? Yeah, down the slope across the river, and... Yeah, that looks like a store, shine, a store sign. Yeah, we tried to go in here earlier, I'm pretty sure. So you're leaving good old cobblestone, are ya? Make sure you got the essentials before you go. Let's buy some stuff. <clears throat> Cypress stick. Um, I mean, is there like few details. Okay. I think my sword is a little better than that, but... We have a bandana on, too. Wayfarer's clothes. Yeah, why not? <clears throat> Maybe it'll be, uh, more fashionable. Give it to Launcher, yeah. Yeah, let's equip it. Oh, uh, we already have three of those and a dodal herb. I think we can buy one of these. Maybe two. The item bag's gonna carry it. Nope. No, thanks so much, though. Thank- yeah, thank you. I hope- I hope you're there to see me off. Uh, is this the exit? No, but I wanna see what's in here. Oh, just the backyard. Alright, any pots I can smash? Don't wanna leave any spot uh, any pots un- unsmashed. Huh. Yeah, so I forgot where they said we're gonna be see seeing be sent seen off at. But it looks like all these houses are open now, so let's Oh! I'm sorry. I totally just ruined your pumpkins. <sighs> Lucky there's no pots I would have ruined those too, honestly. Yeah, I wanna go in the church before I leave. I'm really glad that there weren't invisible walls there. I was like surprised already by a few of the spots that didn't have walls. <laughs> Let's talk to- oh, that's who you are. Perhaps a little prayer before you depart. Confession. Oh, that's really interesting, actually. So, divination, learn how much experience you need to level up, resurrection is- okay, this is really cool. I did not expect this to be the way this was gonna work. Okay, this is really cool. Yeah, I'll save the game. Let's see how that goes. Yep, save it on launcher. Yeah. I think I came in here, because I would have just totally quit. Yeah, I'm gonna keep going for a little bit. No, we're good. Thanks, bro. What's in here? No, can't go through that one. 
Can I take a seat? No. All right. Well, it was nice to it was nice praying. Yeah, cool church. Look at those stained glass windows. Yeah. This game is so pretty. What you gotta say to me? Before you head off, you really should have a quick pray. Yeah. You wanna pray before you do shit. How do I jump? No, not that. There we go. What's you gotta say? Here's some advice from one bloke to another. Keep your mind on the job. No matter how feast the fighting gets, you have to stay focused. The more you get warped, the more focused you'll get. And before you know it, you'll be all pepped up. Then you'll be really full of beans. When you're pepped up, you'll be stronger, faster, better at everything. There ain't another feeling like it. Go on, my son. Get out there and pep yourself silly. I'm not sure exactly what you were insinuating, but also you could beat me up. Like, look at the these muscles. Like, he could really probably kill me. Why aren't you going on this adventure? I want him as my party. Who are you? Oh, you're that kid. No, I don't care about you, dude. Sorry. I mean, I wish you the best, but I'm not going to talk to you on purpose. Nothing in here. Oh, there's a fire pit. Jeez, some of the things that have physics in this game just really surprise me. Oh, I definitely passed up some barrels earlier, I think. It's alright. <laughs> I really enjoy that you can run into some of these things. That's really funny. Can I jump in here? Alrighty. Good to know. Good to know. I'm just not used to like being able to have any maneuverability in these kinds of games. It's gonna take me a second to remember all that. Is that my ma? No. Yeah, so this is it, little soldier's really leaving. Might not be back for a while. Hope you've said y'all goodbyes. You ready? I feel like I should go find Gemma. She's being uh, You know, I don't even want to see her, but... Sorry, I don't know why I was doing the accent. I don't know why, but I feel like she might have something to give me if... Aw. Mystery. If we go see her, so... If not, I'll cut this out, but I'm gonna see if I can find her real quick. I uh, don't need to... Also, that definitely the whole town was not waiting for us. They were just like out and about. They weren't waiting to see me off. Maybe when I actually click the leave button, they'll be like, yeah, bye. Yeah, I think we're done here. There's nothing left for me in this town. Let's get out of here. We'll skedaddle. All right, bye. Thanks for, oh, I guess a few of them were off. We're up here. See me off. I want all these guys over here. I didn't even see them. Yeah, I'm done. Well, off you go then. Okay, there's a bit of a crowd. One day you're just a little boy, the next you're getting ready to leave us. I only wish your grandfather could see what a fine young man you've become. <laughs> to think, it's been so many years already since old Chalky found you floating in... What do you mean? Since he brought you to Cobblestone. Good cover up, Dunstan. There was anything out of the ordinary about you. And now suddenly there's all this talk of luminaries of all things. You know who the luminary was, of course. A legendary hero who saved the world from a terrible darkness. Yeah, you know, I, th I think I heard something about that a little Aren't earlier. You're supposed to believe that you're him reincarnated. <laughs> I don't doubt old Chalky, of course. But it is a little hard to swallow, I must say. Pills that are hard to swallow, bro. Oh, when you meet the King of Heliodor, put in a good word for old Cobblestone, won't you, eh? <laughs> sure, you just send Gemma off and I will give him all of the good words I can. If he finds out this is the village where the luminary was raised, there might be something in it for us, <laughs> if you catch my drift. Oh, I gotcha. You are terrible! Trust you to be thinking about what you can get out of it. Hey, I mean, he's looking after a whole town. I mean, it's not really selfish. Oh, no, I'm only joking, of course! The very thought! <laughs> anyway, where was I? Ah, yes. No. The fate that awaits you may well be one beyond anything we simple country folk can imagine. But you must allow us to offer what little assistance we can. 
Take this map of Erdria with you. May it prove useful in finding your way. Thanks, man. Yeah, we could use a map. I don't want to get lost out there. No way, you're giving me a horse, bro? And may this magnificent steed, the pride of cobblestone, the pride of the whole town? Yes, man. Got a pona. easily enough. Just head north out of the village and follow your nose. Okay. Go straight ahead. You travel safely now. Oh, you're such a good boy. Such a good boy. You make us proud out there, won't you? And come back safe. Oh, God, Ma, please. Okay, bye, everybody. Bye. It was really nice knowing you. Oh, fuck. Here. Take this with you. I... I made it for you. Gemma's charm. It'll keep you safe. I heard there are lots of monsters where you're going. Be sure to keep it close, won't you? I'm literally throwing it in a bush. I don't know what's in store for you out there. But wherever you go and whoever you meet, don't... Don't forget us, will you? Oh, I will. Take care. And remember, we'll be waiting for you. Waiting a long time, Gemma. Bye. God, I'm glad to be out of that shithole. Just kidding, it was cute town. Glad I'm away from Gemma. Higher characters' agility stat, the better chance of acting first in battle, and the more nimbly they will be able to avoid enemy attacks. All right, need a horse? Nay, brother. Horses are an incredibly convenient way to cover large amounts of ground in a little time. But sometimes we'll have to enter areas that can only be explored on foot. Don't despair though, a ring and one of many this on one of many summoning bells dotted around Erdria will soon bring your faithful friend galloping back to your side. Cool. Alright guys, I'm gonna call this an episode. We'll start uh, making our way to Heliodor next and uh, get on with our adventure. Thanks so much for watching.